they have to do so they either bite your like, wrist or they bite or they just drag you away and like take it to their sex dungeon which I love being in that sex dungeon. It's very, very hot and steamy. And what's up, guys? And in today's video, yes, you saw a title and a thumbnail around. We are getting Mr. Gold on the XM4. Uh, with the intro out of the way, let's just get straight into today's video. Oh, okay, this is gonna be really, okay. First thing is first. Um, the camo challenge is we have to get for 10 kills in 45 seconds, which is pretty easy. This is why I chose to do the gold challenge. I changed my mind about the camo grind. I won't be doing multiplayer first. I will be doing zombies first because zombies seems a little bit easier than multiplayer. And, um, multiplayer is just full of sweats. With this one, after we get uh, Mystic Gold, we'll be getting to round 20 and trying to successfully exfil. Um, sadly, la last night I tried to get to round 100, but I died due to a glitch that is in the game, where after like round 40 or round 45, uh, any explosives or anything like that has like electric uh, um, animation. Honestly, I didn't think that I would have to deal with glitches. I mean, it's a new game, so of course it's going to have glitches, you know. And um, I love this game, even though it has the um, invisible um, bomb glitch, which is what I'm going to call it. Um, <laughs> uh, kind of funny. Hold on, guys. I need to crack one of these real quick. Yes, I just cracked a f***ing energy drink because I am dead tired. <laughs> uh, if you guys don't know how to open up the vault, look at that, see? There's a code there. Um, so there's like three codes around the map and they open up the vault, which is access accessible every single round. And you get like a 45 second grace period of no zombies, which is pretty nice. Uh, my friend showed me on how to do get into the vault uh, when I was playing with him, which is pretty nice. And it's pretty cool that people are already figuring out stuff um, on like day three of like the release of zombies. I mean, people have probably already nearly like halfway done the freaking um, Easter egg probably, wouldn't bloody surprise me. Okay, so if you don't know where Pack-a-Punch is on Liberty Falls, it is up in the church. Which is pretty cool, and you don't need to turn power on this map, which is also really cool. And the spiders scare the freaking shit out of me, cause it, it's a like a scorpion thing with spider legs and like a zombie head backwards, with like a big ass mouth, and it's so bloody creepy. Like this is gonna be a very interesting um, camo grind. So basically, you guys are gonna see a video every single day of me getting uh, all these weapon weapons gold. I'm not gonna post videos on um, getting the base camos. Uh, those will be streamed, and I'll also be streaming uh, leveling up my gun and so on and so forth. So if you guys want to check that out, um, my stream will pro my stream is probably just been put up on screen. Like, when this game dropped, I streamed for a solid 8 hours, not even joking. Shit was ridiculous. Another thing that annoys me with Liberty Falls is that there's so many <coughs> mini-bosses per round. And I wanna ask s something real quick. How the <coughs> does someone get to round 170, was it? And that was like the night of the game dropping. He, he obviously found a glitch or something because... It ain't legit. I can set it with full heart, with 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 every thing, single thought in in process. It is not legit. Like I want to believe that someone got to around 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 170, but nah, <laughs> I don't believe it. When the zombies kill you, they have like a finisher. It's pretty cool. They have two finishers. They either bite your like, wrist or they bite. Or they just drag you away and like take it to their sex dungeon, which I love being in their sex dungeon. It's very, very hot and steamy. And like, and if you're wondering where the other vault, um, 
Koza, it's ones right here, and the vaults here. And there's three freaking codes. Uh, let's get this. Okay, cool. Now we've got the upgrade. I feel like that. I feel like they should lessen the amount of manglers like that spawn in on the higher rounds. Because the manglers already get more and more health as like the rounds like go on. And the funny thing is, uh, on like round 40, you get like two mega abominations to three mega abominations, which uh, I need to bleep that out. Um, <laughs> uh, I try to bleep, I'm gonna try and bleep out all my swearing from now on. Uh, try to at least, but with the hour long vi VODs, I won't be. Because I can't be stuffed editing uh, like two hours uh, of gameplay. I really can't be asked. It just takes way too long because I gotta do captions, gotta do um, sensors, gotta ma just make it interesting, you know? And I really hate the fact. Oh my god, it's a spider here. And if you guys didn't know, after your first spider round, the spiders um, come after you mid rounds, which is pretty nice, but they don't sprint at you. I feel like with the spider rounds, uh, they get faster. I love the pack punch camo, it's so cool. I absolutely love it. And the tier 3 pack is also really cool. Absolutely love it. So, what was it again? I have to get like 10 kills in 45 seconds or something. I don't remember. <laughs> Uh, well, if the camera pops up on the screen, we, it pops up on screen. As I said at the start of the video, um, we are going into like round 20, I think it was, or something. <coughs> yeah, round 20. Uh, I was training them up so I can kill them, kill 10 zombies in 45 seconds. That looks like 10 zombies. I literally just destroyed those zombies. Was that 10 zombies? Don't know. Oh, I almost count. One, two, four. Two thousand years later. Nine. Yeah, that's 10. 10 that lot. So we killed one lot of 10 zombies. Okay, now for the next. Oh, we just killed all the spiders. Now, I, I didn't have arachophobia before this game came out, but now I do have arachophobia. When I see a creature with eight legs, I literally kill it on the spot and then start teabagging the shit out of it. <laughs> Imagine that, just walking into someone just teabagging a bloody spider. Oh my god. The fuck is wrong with my brain? Jesus Christ. I can't, I can't with the stupidest things. Now, for first pack it's 5,000, and second pack it's 15. And for third pack, it is 30,000. Just to let you guys know. Uh, this should be 10 zombies. Just gotta hold them up a little bit closer. Absolutely demolished. Uh, that should be 10. If you guys are enjoying this video, please make sure to subscribe, like, and comment. Because I'm trying to get to 1,000 subscribers by the end of the year. And only you guys can make that possible. Uh, we nearly got enough for pack, so that's great. Come on, zombies, hold up. And not you, not you, spider. Now, this is a horde of more than 10, so. Uh, weapon challenge complete. Unlock Mystic. Hey, we unlocked Mystic Gold. Woohoo. Uh, now we just have to get to round 20. That's not too hard. Uh, the second pack looks like this. Looks pretty cool. It's, uh... I'm trying to inspect it, but I can't inspect it. Jesus fucking Christ. Zombies are hitting me hard today. Grab that. Uh, now that we got second armor. Now, you can get, uh, like, tier 3 armor. It's just that it's over at, at church, and it costs, like, $14,000. Just to get. It's pretty good, don't get me wrong, but I just can't be. I, I, I just don't have enough points for it. 
Now, if you don't, like, kill all the zombies, um, in the Axfil area, um, you do die. Like, instantly. You, even if you have a quick revive, you, you die instantly because you go into go into the helicopter. And, um, then, like, a mangler like, jumps up and just puts a cannon in the helicopter's ass and blows and blows at a new Mega Abomination decide to show up and is running directly at me. Very scary. You know, the Mega Abomination sprinting towards me reminds me of my um dog Karma. He's a Rottweiler and when he runs, he's such a big boy. He looks really terrifying if you're like new, new around him. Like, you introduce a new person to him. He, he, and he runs from the other side of the goddamn um, yard towards them. They get shit scared. I mean, I would too if I didn't know him. that he was friendly. But we've had come for like 10 years now. The um, Walt Wheeler only has a lifespan of like 10 years, I'm pretty sure. Some, it's like a husky can live up to like 15 years or some shit. So we're gonna have our husky for longer than uh, our Wattwiller, which sucks. It's gonna suck the day that I'm gonna, that I'm gonna have to bury Karma. Oh well, yeah, we can find the exfil. Ah, uh, that's easy. <laughs> successful exfil. <laughs> that's the easy way of doing that successful. Just grab a <laughs> chopper gunner and just like a mole down. And there's also an animation of um, leaving the place, which is pretty cool. Alright, this is what the gold camera looks like in game, kind of like a uh, review weapon. Yep, okay. Look at this sexy thing. I love the gold camera and its gun. It looks so sick. Alright, let's have a little look. Oh my god, it's so cool. I love it. Alright, let's shoot a zombie with it. Oh my god, this is so cool. I love it. Anyways, if you guys loved this video, please make sure to subscribe, like, and comment. And as always, I will see you all in the next one. Peace.